Hello people, how's it going? This is V and welcome back to my channel. Well, I'm starting a new episode of Naruto Shippuden. I'm starting episode 201. Well, I'm really pissed and I'm still mad that they made Danzo head of this uh, joint allied forces of the Shinobi nations. I am not sure why all other characters would agree to it. They should actually show their disapproval. I hope they do it in this episode. Well, while we are at the topic of Dan I would also like to mention something that I noticed when I was editing episode 173 174 for YouTube. Well, I noticed that, um, you know, during that scene when uh, Hanzo has hostage, uh, Conan as hostage, uh, there was a glimpse of young Danzo in that scene. And even then, Danzo had bandages on his eye. So when in the last episode, I was um, guessing that probably he stole someone's eye when Itachi killed the whole clan. I think it has to happen before that. Because uh, that um, that era when uh, Danzo was helping uh, Hanzo was around Second Ninja War, right? And... Itachi killed Uchiha clan after the second war. So between that period, after second war and before Itachi killed the whole clan, Danzo stole someone's eye between that period. I think if my timeline is correct, maybe that is what has happened and not after Itachi killed the whole clan. I'm not sure whose eye he has, but probably we'll find that out later in the series. All right, then let's hop in. But a quick reminder, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do so right away. Hit that big bell icon so that you never miss out any of my videos and all my reaction videos available on Patreon a week before YouTube and edited uncensored. All right, then let's hop in. Okay. I think they're making their move. All right. I think we're gonna go into that room where all Kage's are meeting. Okay, another battle coming up soon. Where'd that white guy go? Yeah, where did Tetsu go? He was just here. Where did he disappear? Oh no, that's the black one. And he's nude! That's Madra, what is he doing sitting on the snow? What, like... Dude, you're gonna catch frostbite. Got it. Yeah. Then begin. Okay, I think he's planning something massive. Is he going in too? Okay, what's happening in Hidden Leaf Village, which is not so hidden anymore? If only Lady Tsunade would wake up from her coma. I know she'd fix this whole mess with Sasuke. Sasuke is a lost cause. Sakura, we have to talk. The last we saw Sai, he was in the forest thinking about his conversation with Naruto. Already? Yeah, his face looks fine. In order to protect Sasuke, he took all of her abuse. Oh, he told her! Yeah, well, she needed to know. Oh my god, that was really brutal. Well, considering how bruised up his face was, he actually healed up really fast. Hmm. But he never sold out Sasuke. Not only that, in order to prevent you from worrying, he asked me to keep it quiet. Well, here you are. Naruto. And now he's on his way to ask the Raikage to pardon Sasuke. What? Why would he be so reckless? Wasn't Kakashi with him? Kakashi Sensei believes in Naruto. Even if it's a long shot, Kakashi wants to give him a chance. <laughs> Shizune is like, this is a stupid plan, it's never gonna work out. Why didn't Kakashi stop him? And Sai is like, Kakashi totally believe in him. He actually took him there on the stupid mission. If Lady Tsunade had been there, she'd have done the same thing. Yeah, she also truly, Sakura. blindly believed in Naruto. Have you told Sakura how you feel? No way. I mean, how could I? I'm the guy who couldn't even keep my promise to her. This is a once-in-a-lifetime request. Just bring him home. Please bring Sasuke back to me. However... Even I am able to see that Naruto's in love with you. 
<laughs> he confronted her. Oh my god. She is shocked to hear that. Oh gosh, Sakura. You must really care about Sasuke, huh? Don't you worry one bit. I'm gonna bring Sasuke back. I promise that on my life, Sakura. Naruto's one-sided love was so true and so pure. He very well knew that once Sasuke comes back to the village, Sakura's gonna go after Sasuke, not gonna come to him. But still, he wanted to bring Sasuke back. It also has to do something about his own uh, affection towards Sasuke, where he takes him as his brother. But still, he knew very well the girl that he is in love with is never gonna be with him once Sasuke comes back. Don't forget, my way of the shinobi means that I'm always going to stand behind what I say. Ah, <laughs> uh, I think Sai's word really struck her hard. Uh. Seems Naruto has shouldered the burden of his promise to you. I don't know what you said to Naruto, but it's really no different than what was done to me. Oh. It's like a curse mark. <gasps> it's obvious that Sasuke is making Naruto suffer. Oh, I'll like Danzo is making him suffer. But I think you may be too. Yeah, when Sai actually laid that out in words like that, kind of makes sense. Like this curse mark, which can paralyze Sai and eventually kill him if he tries to break that. Similarly, this promise is has bounded Naruto and Sakura in a fashion that they're trying everything. They're even, they don't even care about their own life just to bring Sasuke back, who doesn't even want to come back in the first place. Why is Eno crying? Eno. Oh, because of this order to assassinate Sasuke. <laughs> Rock Lee. Hey, that reminds me what happened to Hinata's uh, confession of love to Naruto. You know how Eno's felt about Sasuke all these years. Uh, yeah, but it can't be helped. She's Things are different now than they were before. If that's Ino's reaction, how will Naruto and Sakura feel? Let's leave it to Shikamaru. Remember that his first mission as squad leader failed. Right. He still feels responsible for that. Just imagine if we had somehow gotten Sasuke back home. Things would it be haunts. different. That's why Shikamaru volunteered to convince her. Naruto genuinely wants to rescue Sasuke. It's not just because of his promise to Sakura. Don't you think that's true? But she's also a contributing yes, factor. I totally agree with you. I've been oh watching Naruto lately, and I think I figured out what he's feeling. It's sadness. Hmm. And then when I think about Sasuke, I get a burning feeling in my gut that that's anger. Quite understandable. We must not rely solely on Naruto anymore. We have to take action ourselves. Sai's right. Oh, he was Shikamaru. listening into the whole conversation. We need to stop the Akatsuki. And then, we have to stop Sasuke. That means kill Sasuke. We can't allow a war to break out between the hidden leaf and the hidden cloud because of Sasuke. What? If the hidden cloud did kill Sasuke, there's no way you or Ino or especially Naruto would just let it be. And if any of you were to lash out recklessly and get killed by Cloud Ninja, oh, it's the whole I nor Choji, vengeance nor cycle. We yeah. go out and avenge it's you. It's the same hatred cycle Naruto the other spoke side about. Will remain quiet. They retaliate too. Right. Before you know and it, we'll be at war. war. If Sasuke continues to align himself with the Akatsuki, the hatred spreading through the world will only grow. So mm. I believe it's time for the Hidden Leaf Village to deal with Sasuke ourselves. Oh my god, this must be tearing Sakura apart, right? And hearing this from Shikamaru in that way, oh my goodness. Sakura has to give consent to a decision which will decide the fate of, or actually which will cause assassination of the one person that she has loved most in her entire life. Oh god, but at the same time I feel it's high time she should open her eyes and what she should uh, listen to Shikamaru because whatever he's saying is absolutely correct. This is kind of what's gonna happen if it if it continues like if they do not stop Sasuke in a, in a way either he comes back or he is killed which I don't want but then that will happen that will lead to wars and you don't want another war. That's why I want your consent. 
Sakura. Don't say anything more. Lord, I feel you. But regardless of what your answer is, I'm going to have to act to protect the Leaf's future. He doesn't care I'll about her opinion. Too. Where is he right now? He went to the Land of Iron to meet with the Raikage. Uh, he's willing to go that far? Right, to save Sasuke and you want to well, kill him. I guess him. I should have known this whole thing was going to be a drag. Since he's the fool that fell for me, I want to do it. Let me take on that role. But I don't understand why Sakura would is like, uh, why is this news for Sakura? She should know, like deep down inside, she should know that Naruto always had uh, some feelings for her because he must have asked her out on a date like at least a hundred times that I know of. I'm the one who caused Naruto the most pain. Don't want to make any more mistakes. I don't want to fail. I'll hmm. do it. What? Okay. Let the Hokage lead the allied shinobi forces? Yes, Raikage, deny this ruling. If all of you approve this, I would gladly and humbly accept this position. Yeah, you would. You always wanted that. Raikage is mad. Why the Hokage? This man is also known by the moniker, the Shinobi of Darkness. What does that mean, Shinobi of Darkness? Then who else? My village has not produced even one single member of the Akatsuki. It ought to be me! I cannot agree to that. What Why? did you say? What is his reason? What is his problem? But someone such as yourself, whose acts are ruled by his emotions, would probably end up splintering an allied force. Okay. I am that simply stating my unbiased opinion as a neutral party. Lord Kazekage is still too young to spearhead such a venture. Lord Tsuchikage, on the other hand, He's is too old. old and gives the impression of one whose power has waned. Lady Mizukage's hidden mist is suspected to be the birthplace of the Akatsuki. There is some concern about possible intelligence leaks. People when he might said wonder it like that. that. Spies. It kind of we makes don't sense. know why the Akatsuki why are gathering the tailed like beasts or what they intend to do with them. The nine tails belongs to the hidden leaf. Thus, I feel it appropriate that the Hokage be named as leader. Something's just not sitting right. Well, you know, I agree whatever he said as a um, reasoning why he selected Danzo. But personally, I know Danzo can go to extreme length. If he becomes like the strongest person in all these uh, shinobi villages, you don't know what extreme measures he's going to take. About this. I need to check it out. Prepare for battle. What? Hmm? Battle? Now? Gyakugan! He has Gyakugan? What? How does he have Gyakugan? Oh. You can see the, the Sharingan. Donzo's right shoulder and right arm. He's checking out his Sharingan. He knows. It's Shisui Uchiha's. Shisui Uchiha? A foe that I fought against once. I'll never forget that color. Shisui Uchiha was, um... Is the same person that Itachi was uh, blamed for, right? That Itachi killed him. Uh, his clan members came to his house, knocking on the door, asking for, you know, uh, there were two people who were missing in the uh, last meeting, and one was Itachi and the other one was Shizui. And then they blamed him in a, in a way that he might be the reason of his disappearance. Or, uh, no, he committed suicide, so they said, someone copied his handwriting and it might not be a suicide and they are kind of um had suspicion on itachi for killing him so that shizui that sharingan i so kind of so danzu killed him and stole his eye how did he do it like shizui will be like she will be like super uh strong he was better than itachi right Lord Hokage, please show us the eye you keep covered under that bandage. <laughs> eh? What? What's the meaning of this? Confronted I believe him. you stole Shisui Uchiha's eye and oh. transplanted it in place of your own. Right, it's my Shisui suspicions are Uchiha's. true. His particular jutsu, 
let him enter the minds of others. Make them go through phantom experiences of his own choosing. Phantom and manipulate experience. them. It was such a top-notch visual jutsu that no one ever even caught on to having been manipulated. Oh. Hokage! Don't tell me Mifune is... <sighs> but how could... My right eye is also a precious spoil of war from a battle against the Hyuga. Ah. So I'm not really one to cast blame. I was able to penetrate the Genjutsu cast upon the fourth Mizukage. How dare you! Okay, now Danzo cannot be... Huh? Oh my oh, god! Hello there! What? The, the white Zesu is here. What is he doing here? One problem after another. Now what? Guess what? Sasuke Uchiha is stuck in here. I wonder. Where do he's, you think he could be hiding right now? He's alarming them about Sasuke. And he's nude. What is all this? Who is he? A member of the Akatsuki. It's like a game of hide and seek. Let's all try to find Sasuke. Come on! <gasps> Raika, he grabbed him. Why isn't he just going inside Give the ground? An right now. He's choking him. Refuse to answer and I'll show you no mercy. Is he gonna kill Zetsu now? Where are you right now? And what are you thinking about? Do you ever think about me? The only time he actually Even thought about you guys. When he fought battle with Killer B and afterwards he was looking at his town comrades. That's the only time I can You remember. defeated your brother Itachi. I don't know what Sasuke is thinking about, to be honest. He just looks so distant. Why won't you come home to the leaf? Because Madra manipulated him. He told him about Itachi's story. Has what it... hatred completely consumed you, Sasuke? Yes. Have you really just become an ordinary criminal? I won't say ordinary criminal. He's really strong. But he is, he is I, on, a, on another vengeance cycle. I'm not sure who you are anymore. Hey. Hmm? We really should talk. <gasps> Woo! Uzumaki. What? Oh my god, so many things happened in this episode at a go at the end of it. Okay, first of all, first thing first, that guy had a Byakugan and he saw, uh, he saw through Danzo Sharingan and power in his arms. So obviously, with after knowing all this, I'm sure he's not going to be the leader of the Shinobi Force, a allied Shinobi Force. So that's a good thing. But I do not understand why would Madara Uchiha and Zetsu rat out Sasuke? Like, what were their motivations in there? They themselves sent Sasuke to kill Danzo. Don't they want Danzo dead? Why would they turn five Kages against Sasuke? That's a question mark here too. And then Madara Uchiha himself is sitting on top of Naruto. Oh my god, I'm worried about Naruto because all he wants is this nine tails and he's gonna try and grab Naruto out from here. But where is Kakashi and Yamato right now? Alright, I think there are too many questions and I should watch the next episode to know more. But I'm gonna wrap it out here. Drop some likes and comments on this video and do subscribe to my channel. Hit that big bell icon so that you never miss out any of my videos. And all my reaction videos available on Patreon a week before YouTube, unedited, uncensored. And you can send me a high five on Instagram or Facebook. Alright, then I'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye!